late they started coming off and i mean it was it was four months in and i was off oxygen and my heart rate was down to 68 beats a minute wow that's crazy yeah. wow what a story and you know you imagine this todd imagine if you would have done what the doctors said i'd be dead i'm not joking i'd be dead they would have killed you mm-hmm. nothing against well I, i'm just saying what it is you know the fact of the matter is the more doctors you go to the more times you seek our health care in our, it, it's a sick care system it they is. love treating sick people they don't want to heal people they love treating sick people and you would definitely be dead um and just by changing your diet, not taking any medications, not going to those specialists, you save your life. For sure. I do. And I know that now, you know, I just like when this is why, you know, when I started realizing and, and listening to Gary Taub and stuff talk that, you know, our medical treatment is the number three leading cause of death. Exactly. In yep. our country. Okay. Yeah. And I'm like. Well, right there is, you know, is a serious, you know, a serious light bulb moment for anybody that our medical treatment is also the third leading cause of death in our country, just behind what is it, heart disease and cancer? Yep. You know, it's like, what does that say? Well, and you could argue, Todd, that the reason our heart disease is the number one killer is because of our medical system. You've got right. most doctors out there preaching low fat diets, no butter, no steak, high carbohydrates. Yep. I I blame doctors for the cardiovascular disease that we have. And do you not think doctors like that? Um, of course they do. Cardiologists make a ton of money off people having heart attacks. For sure. And, and you know, give them by give them one bypass, two years later, give them another bypass. Put right. stents in, two years later, put another stint in. They love it. I mean, seriously, I mean, and that's why you have to take charge of your own health. That's our goal of our podcast, to educate and empower individuals to take charge of their own health. 